the Augusta Westland AW139 is one of the most popular utility helicopters today, both in the military and civilian sectors. Its performance has allowed it to become popular amongst operators supporting the offshore oil and gas industry. A dedicated military model, the AW139M, was also developed by Augusta Westland. It was first purchased by the Italian Air Force. Other military operators include the U.S. Air Force, which operates the MH-139 Grey Gulf model. The AW-139 was later developed into the AW-149, an extended medium-lift military-oriented helicopter. The Augusta Westland AW-139 is marketed at several different roles, including VIP, military use, offshore transport, firefighting, law enforcement, search and rescue, emergency medical service, disaster relief, and maritime patrol. The AW-139 had its first flight on February 3, 2001. The helicopter entered revenue service during 2003 and quickly proved itself to be a commercial success. The AW-139 was built as a conventional twin-engine Manteron helicopter. It has a five-bladed, fully articulated main rotor with a titanium hub and composite blades and a four-bladed articulated tail rotor. It is fitted with a retractable tricycle landing gear, the two F wheels retracting into external sponsors, which are also used to house emergency equipment. The crew of two pilots, with up to 15 passengers, accommodated in three rows of five. The AW-139 is powered by two fed controlled Pratt and Whitney Canada PT-60 turbocharged engines, giving a top speed of up to 310 km per hour, a range of 1,061 km, a service ceiling of 6,000 m, and a rate of climb is 10.9 m per second. More than a thousand customizable items of equipment can be configured per customer demand, including auxiliary fuel tanks, rescue hoists, cargo hooks, search and weather radar, ice protection systems, external cameras, and shirt lights, and seating arrangements. Although an option on early models, most aircraft includes a 4-axis autopilot, which allows higher levels of automation and safety, and enables advanced functions, such as auto-hover. This level of automation has allowed certification for single-pilot operations under instrument flight rules conditions. And the cockpit can also optionally be modified for compatibility with night vision googles. The AW-139 is loved by dozens of military and civilian operators throughout the world. The AW-139M, a fully militarized version. It can be armed with internal and external weapons, such as general-purpose machine guns, sniper rifles, heavy machine gun ports, and 70mm rocket ports, forward-firing rockets and machine guns, Pinter mounted machine gun and air to surface missile system. The cockpit and cabin can be equipped with ballistic protection. The crew protection is further improved with armor seats.